Okay, try to stay, try to keep up with Ryan, okay? It'll start, but if I give it gas, it just bogs out and dies, so I don't know. Just remember, if it starts bogging in the turn, to downshift, okay? Mason's Husky 50 isn't starting right now, so we're gonna let him try a loose bike for a bit. Oh, my God. 
go that fast. Why didn't you tell me your bike could go that fast, Luke? He's actually going to blow it up. Freshly watered this section, so it might be a little too slick for what he's used to, or it could be awesome traction. We'll find out. update about the YZ250 that I was looking at. Originally, the guy said it was a 95, I think. Originally though, I thought it was a 92, but then when I was editing, I noticed that the side number plates didn't have the little handholds and uh, the front fender was obviously not a 92. It didn't have like the scoop rounded front fender. So I'm thinking maybe it's like a 91 or maybe an 89 now. Either way, I'm, I'm gonna pass. I mean, I. I wasn't too excited about a 250, but it's just too old and I don't think it's gonna be, um, it's gonna be a lot of work and maybe too risky. I, I might not get all my money back out of it. So I'm gonna pass on that one. I did actually find one bike that looks pretty good. It's a 01 YZ125 and uh, he's asking $2,000, but the guy is a really good negotiator. He's asking 2,000, but the absolute lowest he'll take is 16. Well, I'm a little intimidated with that good of a negotiator. <laughs> <laughs> 